Welcome to Ballistic High Speed, where we combine two of the greatest things on planet Earth. Super slow motion. And firearms and firearm physics. I'm Adam. I'm Bryce. Join us on our journey for Ballistic High Speed. Welcome back again to Ballistic High Speed. Today we have another collaboration video with Grind Hard Ammo. They sent out this anatomically correct ballistic torso made by Ballistic Dummy Lab. If you remember our video with Abe, we found the rest of him. Yeah. And it doesn't look like he's gonna have any better of a day today. No, another bad day for sure for Abe. Um, we're gonna be focusing exclusively on handguns today. We're gonna start with a nine millimeter Glock. We're gonna then move into a Sig Sauer 45, and we will be chambering both of these with Grindhard Ammo's Extreme Defense Rounds. Yep, and then if we're feeling a bit cheeky, we might just do a mag dump and do it. See what happens. And it'll all be caught in glorious high speed. Yes, super slow motion. Let's get to it. All right, this is nine millimeter extreme defense against the torso, first shot. Count it down. Go on. Three, two, one. It just opens up a tunnel inside you. Just trying to like imagine that. Yeah. Oh my God. Because like to think about that in your body of just this tunnel opening up through your torso and then collapsing again. Even just watching that cavitation, like it amazes me that a human can withstand that. I gotta say that looks awfully realistic. That is a nice, a nice hole. I mean, I mean, it lines up with what that round would be. I haven't looked very far back yet. Where's the round? Oh, wait, what? Did it curve over into the... So it, it broke some of the PVC piping yeah. and fell. Is the bullet down there in the grass? So I think it hit our pipe in there and fell. Or it's still stuck in there, but it didn't go through. I say we put a shot up in the chest, see what happens through the heart or maybe a rib. This is nine millimeter take two against the ballistic torso in the chest. High speed is ready when you are. Okay. In three, two, one. Oh, it came out. Ooh. Awesome. It looks like it's toppling like a corkscrew. See that? Yeah. That's pretty cool. And from what I've heard, a gunshot feels more like a really, really hard punch than it feels like actually being torn through. Watching these, which makes sense. I can see it. Like serrating. It looks like a Phillips head sticking that out. did down here. Oh, look at that. You can see that corkscrew action now that it's filled with blood. Oh, you're right. You can see the edges twisting and it's filled with blood now. That's so cool. Where's the exit hole? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Ooh, you'll have to tell me what bone that is. Uh, I think that's the scapula. It's kind of cool how it, it's also still contained in there though. This really demonstrates how, how much damage is stuck inside you after this kind of stuff. Like there's bones floating in your flesh, basically. I think we should put a 45 through it. Yeah, see what we see. Absolutely, that's gonna be much more energy. All right, high speed's ready. Shooter ready in three, two, one. Nice. Yeah, that was gnarly. Oh, look at that. My. That's like three times bigger than the nine mil. Did it not come out? It caught it. It's about to pull it back in, I think. Stop it. Look at that. <laughs> it caught it right at the edge. It was like perfect. Oh, I hope we can find that one. Oh, we will. Look at that laceration. Immediate. I mean, that's a deep split too. This blood just was gushing out. I gotta see the back though. <laughs> oh, there it is. That's perfect. How crazy is that? And on the high speed, I mean, it probably came out to what, like here? Yeah. I wondered why I didn't see it with the flex camera, because it didn't come out. That's so cool. We'll have to dig that out yeah. later. Yeah. That's so cool. And ready when you are. You're all set? Okay. In three, two, one. Noticeably more energy. It's not even close.
And this is still just a handgun round. This is a great comparison against the 9mm. Look at the size difference. Would you find the rib? Yeah, look at his rib. Shattered right off. Yep. The cool part is it had to make it out of that cavitation though, before it closed back up. It basically just made one huge laceration now. All right, let's see the back. Oh yep, there's the hole. That's the cleanest and biggest hole of all of them, right there. Sure That's is. so cool. Wow. All right, well, what do you say is next? I think we have to do a mag dump. Both of us? Yeah, we might as well. Let's do it. 9.45, just pummel them. Mm -hmm. We're gonna fire as fast as we can while remaining relatively efficient. Are we ready? Yep. All right, three, two, one. You had a lot more bullets than me. <laughs> you got through yours a lot faster. Yeah. Clear. Clear. Okay. Yeah, I think that was, I think that was good. That was very, very good. That was some good results. For There's sure. a lot of carnage where there should be a nipple. There's just a, a hole. Yeah. Large chunk out of the especially back here. Especially on the back, yeah. The spine is sticking out of his back. I did like that we got the the side-by-side -side comparison, both shooting yeah. nine versus 45. I mean, that is like the age old internet fight of well now you can see why 45 is so much more highly recommended for home defense there's just no contest between the two especially with this defense ammo good stuff though um we do have two more of these and next video we're going to be doing some rifle calibers rifles indeed specifically 300 blackout yep. and 65 creedmoor Six Creed which should be pretty gnarly so if you think this was cool wait till the next video we're not going to tell you what the third one's going to be used for but let's just say it'll be some explosive fun is yeah. that okay to say? I think so. Well, that might people might think it's a, but I don't think we're going to cool. say that word on YouTube. Good point. <laughs> so thanks again to Grindheart Ammo for sending out some cool stuff for us to test, and thanks again to Ballistic Dummy Lab for making the cool stuff. And uh, feel free to follow us on social media, subscribe on YouTube. We'll see you in the next one.